uh, I, I call almost an uh, incredible act of disrespect when we do ad packs every year. When, when we could have agreed to it ahead of time. Yes. We could know what we already could have agreed to and not drag people out at the 11th hour uh, and then have you uh, bring out all of your ammunition, all of the people, all of the elders, all of the disabled folks, people that could have agreed to, we didn't have to drag you out. If we agreed to ahead of time, things that we uh, should have agreed to as being the core level of services that we could uh, that we could avoid this. So that's part of why we're doing this early uh, is to make sure we have these agreements. We have a big budget. You know, the city's 6.6 .6 million dollar budget, billion dollar budget, is one that probably a lot of you don't understand the in intricacies of it. But a good portion of that goes to police services, the fire services, the social services that you value the most. And what I try to do in spreading the word with our commissioners, with our department heads, and with you here tonight, is I gave three general principles to guide us. I want the city to be safe. Not only safe in the public safety sense, but safe in the core level of social services, uh, safety net safe. I want the city to be solvent, that we have programs that we can afford to pay for. And then I want the city to be successful as we've always been. That is, that we celebrate and try to support all of the diverse things that we do that bring uh, visitors here, that keep our children here, that keep families wanting to come and grow up here. So safe, solvent, and successful have been the three principles that I've shared with city staff and with uh, commissioners and with presidents of commission as we begin this budget process. Tonight, though, is all about listening to you, first and foremost, and getting that uh, input that we've always said we value, and that I truly value. So I'm going to be listening very carefully to what you all have to say, and trying to make that balance. A $380 million balance is not easy to do, and, and there will be decisions that we all have to make, and we have to come together to make those decisions so that we have a balanced budget. So with that, uh, I'm going to start my ears open and uh, listening to what everybody has to say and that we will have a budget that I believe will be an honest one that reflects everybody's input. Thank you very much.